Hi everyone, welcome to Tala Dalal's Kitchen. I am Mansi, and today I'm going to show you a very nice farar recipe which you can have during these nine Navratri days or during any other fasting days, which is Rajgira Paneer Paratha. This paratha is a meal in itself. It has a stuffing of paneer, which who wouldn't like? And you can also enjoy this with curd or chutney. So come on, let's start making this recipe. So first, we'll make the stuffing for this paratha using paneer. For that, we'll take some paneer, some green chilies for a little spice, lemon juice, powdered sugar. some coriander coriander is optional because some people do not prefer adding this to their recipes and finally some rock salt some people add table salt in their fasting recipes so it's your choice if you want to add it now we'll mix all this nicely the stuffing is mixed nicely now and we'll start making the dough so for the dough first we'll take some rajgira flour some boiled peeled and mashed potatoes black pepper powder and some rock salt and now we'll knead it into a semi soft dough using enough water You can see here our dough is nicely kneaded now. Remember one thing, rajgira dough does not need any resting time. So start making the parathas immediately. First, we take a portion of the dough and start rolling it using enough rajgira flour. Do the rolling using a very light hand because it may start breaking. Roll it into a 3 inch diameter circle so that there is enough space for putting the stuffing. Now take a portion of the stuffing and place a portion of the stuffing in the center. Bring all the edges on the center so that covers the stuffing nicely. Rajgira is a little difficult to roll. Now slightly even it out with your hand. You need a lot of practice to make this. Press it nicely from all the sides so that it forms a nice circle and so it's easy to roll it out. Now roll this paratha using enough rajgira flour. Do it with a very light hand so that the stuffing doesn't come out. If you require more flour, do take some more. Remember to put flour on both the sides and then roll it. It will become easier to roll out the paratha. A paratha is nicely rolled. Now we lift it very gently and put it on a tawa. Remember one thing let the paratha roast on one side very nicely because there are chances of it to start breaking if it is not done nicely now we'll turn it on the other side again do it gently yes you can see it is nicely cooked on one side we'll take some oil and brush it on this side now we'll turn it again yes you can see it's very nicely cooked we'll again put some oil on this side It's cooked nicely. We'll remove it from the gas and place it on a plate. Like this, we'll make the remaining parathas. Our Rajgira paneer parathas are ready. You can serve it with chutney or curd and enjoy it. Download the Tala Dalal app on your Apple and Android devices. Follow us on the Facebook at taladalal.com. If you enjoy our recipes, click like to see. more of my recipes click here please share your comments i would love to hear them i'm waiting for them